So says the Gemara, every Jew turns to Hashem and tells him, Hashem, I don't want to do any Averot. It's not my retzonot, it's not, it's not my will, I don't want to do it. The problem is, Seol Shebe Isa Me'akevet, the Yetzirah, the Yetzirah doesn't let us go. He has us by the neck and he doesn't let us do what we really want and serve you. Now why is the Gemara comparing the Yetzirah to yeast? Because just like yeast, it makes the dough rise, it makes something that's nothing into something. So to the Yetzirah is the best. As, as the best is making everything into something. The most small thing is the best businessman in the world. He can sell you any product. Something that's cheap, he makes it look expensive. Something that's really not fun, he makes it look as if it's fun. And a person can give up his whole life falling into the Yetzirah of selling him products that are total fake and he thinks it's the most best thing in the world and he sells his Torah for it. He sells his Judaism for it. He sells his Tefillah for it. A person can even marry a guy. The Yetzirah totally fools him, fools him. He sells him this thing as if it's the best thing, but he totally got him. He knows how to blow everything up. You know, the other week I had a, I had a Macy's um, discount card. And it said on the Macy's, it was a small card, and it said in big, big letters, 25% off. It was like golden red letters. It had the numbers 25% off on Macy's. So I was all happy. Now I can buy my wife a gift, 25% off. But then the, the group that I learned with in Brooklyn told me that you got fooled. You turned the card around and you see the terms and conditions. It was seriously a whole Megillah. It was seriously, accept this, accept this, accept this, only this, only this, and only that, and only that, and only that. So I thought to myself, what a beautiful mashat to the Yitzhara. The Yitzhara goes around and he tells you, guys, 25% off. This is the best life in the world. Go to Florida, you have the best time of your life. Go buy this car, go buy this house, do this and do that. He knows how to blow everything up like this. But when you flip it around, and you look at the terms and conditions that comes with every sin that a person does, that comes with that instant enjoyment that a person does in Avra, the terms and conditions are massive. Chas you disconnect from Hashem. The next day when you put into feeling, you're not going to feel the Kedusha. Every time you daven, until you do tshuva, you hardly feel it. And all the Yisurim, Chas Shalom, the pain that comes from every Avra is just not worth it. But the Yetzirah knows that a fool a person to only look at the 25% off, only look at the fun part as if it's the best deal in the world that he tricked you he got you thank you for listening to the guard your eyes daily chizuk broadcast pass them on to your friends and help spread kedusha in the world